welcome to my channel in this video i'm going to show you how you can convert the name of a country into its corresponding continent using python and pandas so in this data set you have country names and then you have their corresponding continent using the same module you can convert the country name into a country code a three digit country code that will be alpha three or a two digit code alpha two so first of all, let's import the pandas library and also the PyCountry convert. We, are, we need, you may need to install the PyCountry and the PyCountry convert using pip install if you do not have them already. So then once you have the two uh, libraries, you can go ahead and load our data. We are going to use the drinks data sets and uh, pd.readcsv and then we pass the, uh, the link where we have the data set. And uh, we can then inspect the first few rows of our data, uh, data frame. As you can see, we select only a small portion of the data to work to demonstrate this exercise 20 items that you're going to do work with. So then once you have the data frame that uh, we're going to work with, we have now create a function which you are going to call convert and it is going to take the value uh, the rows because you're going to convert each row of the data frame and uh, once we have that we, uh, the first step you're going to do is to convert the country name into the country code so if you see the documentation of the the pi country convert you know that we cannot convert directly from the country name to the tree uh, the continent name so we have first to convert from country name into country alpha 2 and then once you have that you can move from country alpha 2 code into the continent name so we define a country code and the country code will convert the name into the alpha 2 as you can see here country code will be, uh, be assigned the value pc so the first line in our function will convert the country name into a country code and the, that code is the one which will do that and it will take the row dot country so that is the uh, the column that you're going to pass into a function and also you have to indicate the default uh, the the format of the country name cn dot format cn underscore format to be we use the default format code will be converting pc dot country alpha 2 to continent code and eventually we return we're going to return the continent code for each row so once function working now we can uh, use the apply function to apply the, the function into our data frame. So however, once you see this, you find that there is an error and uh, we have an invalid country, Antigua and Barbuda. So let's first look at our data frame and see where the country is flagged as invalid. So as you can see here, I found that uh, the error was arising because uh, in the documentation, uh, the and in uh, is the English expression and, but in our data frame, we have used the symbol for and. So first of all, we need to change that. We are going to change the name to Antigua and with the and being the English expression rather than the sign. And so with that there, it's going to solve uh, the error that had been. Once we have renamed that country, we can now rerun our code and that is now fixed. As you can see now, we have all the country codes, continent codes for each of the country in our data frame. So suppose that we wanted to have the, the complete names of the continents, we can use the map function and we're going to map each of the continent codes into their respective full name. So first of all, we create a dictionary 
called continent names or continents. So for each of the continent, we have the key as their code and the full names as their values. So finally, we're going to pass this dictionary into the map function of data frame to be able to find our complete data frame with the continent names as you can see here. Right. So this is now our new column which contains all our country of the corresponding country. So this is uh, how we're able to map the, a country name into a continent name. And uh, if you look uh, at the documentation for Pi Country Convert, it has so many uh, other uses. You can convert to uh, country codes of two or country codes of uh, three digits. So thank you for watching. If you found this uh, video useful, please like it and subscribe and share. Thank you for watching.